kitchri and corned beef for dinner today. I hope you like this recipe. You will like, subscribe, give me a thumbs up and let me know what you think about this video. It's a very simple recipe and it's an easy dish to make when you have nothing really to cook. So these are the ingredients. This is one cup of split peas, yellow split peas. It's, it has been soaked for two hours. One cup of rice soaking. Uh, some kale, oil, dry thyme leaves, corned beef, onion, garlic, pepper, mixed green beans, adobo, coriander, turmeric, and some roasted jeera or cumin. Let's do it! In this rice cooker, I'm going to add one tablespoon of oil. I'll just wait for it to get hot now. Oh, this oil should be hot by now. I'm going to add the onion, the pepper, and the garlic. This looks good. I'm going to go ahead now and add um, the dry thyme leaves, the cumin, the coriander, the turmeric, and some adobo. Just cover it back and let it let it cook for about three minutes. I'm going to add the split peas. well. I'm going to add one cup of hot water. And I'm going to cover this and let it cook until the split peas is about half cooked. Then I will add the rice. Now this is how the dal is looking right now. I can check it to see if it's half cooked. And yeah, it's pretty good. So I'm going to go ahead and add the rice to this. The one cup of rice. Mix this well. And I'm going to add now two cups of water to this rice. I'm just going to give it a taste to see if it has enough salt. Mm. 
and this is perfect I also need to add my kale to this rice I'm just gonna add like two handful of frozen kale I'm just gonna wait now for the rice to finish cooking and then my dinner is ready well the rice cooker just came off and the rice is finished cooking I'm going to check to see how it looks looks like it's well cooked I'm just gonna fluff it up a little I'm gonna cover it and let it sit for five minutes and then I'll serve myself in this skillet I'm gonna add one tablespoon of oil okay I'm going to add the onion garlic and pepper Added the garlic. I'm adding a dash of black pepper, a handful of dry thyme leaves, Just let this fry for a little. I'm going to add a can of corned beef. I'm going to add my can of string beans. Just going to cover it, let it cook for about five minutes. So it's been about five minutes, and this green beans and Corn beef is now ready. I'm going to go ahead and take this down. Corn beef doesn't really need to be cooked much and so is the green beans. So this is ready. I did not have to add any salt because the corn beef already has a lot of salt. That is why I added the green beans. Here you have my tasty kitchri with corned beef and green beans. Now it's time to taste this delicious kitchri. Wow, the rice is well cooked and so is the split peas. Very nice, perfect. Just the right amount of salt. And with the corned beef, Mmm, this is so yummy. Really nice. Delicious. Oh, it's so nice. The, da the split peas is well cooked. So is the rice and the corned beef. I hope you like this recipe. You will try it. You'll like and subscribe to my channel 
and hit the bell so you can get notification whenever I upload new videos.